double ball hitch was sent to me at no charge for the purpose of this review and it is a slider hitch most times people use these for a drop hitch uh, especially if you've got a lifted truck or a larger truck uh, this is going to come in handy so that you can uh, hook your trailers up a lot easier you got a two inch ball and you got a two and five sixteen inch ball and that goes into a two inch receiver not the two and a half inch but the two inch receiver they also give you a hitch pin to lock your, your, your slider ball in place. And they give you a locking pin. Uh, you got two adjustment holes on your hitch that you can slide into your receiver. I think the way that I'm gonna do mine today is just like that. And then these are gonna screw in. On the head of these bolts, there is uh, there is room for you to get this little tool in here and tighten these down. Now, I would say that once you got this in, you're going to want to leave it. Now, I don't typically use a two and five sixteenths inch balls, so I'm going to pull my pin, slide that in there, and I can put that any place that I would like. Lock it in. And you're good to go. So that is the uh, the rise or drop two inch, two and five sixteen inch double ball hitch. Definitely would recommend this. I'm not quite sure how well I like uh, having to screw in the hitch pin into the receiver. Keep that in your toolbox so that if you ever need to pull your hitch out, uh, you're prepared and ready to go. You're not going to be able to get a, a ratchet on here or a, a pair of pliers or anything, you're going to need a little wrench just like this in order to get in there and to either tighten or to remove. So there you go.